hey guys welcome back to the channel hope you guys are doing well in today's video guys we are gonna be looking at another evolution review just like the one we did for the week foot peak where we took our 85 rated varan to our 95 rate 90 rated varan my bad in today's video we are gonna be looking at the same evolution but i've done two of those so you can basically everybody can do this it is like free to play players and for pay to play players obviously free to play can do then play to play can also do and in today's video we are going to be looking at the birthday magic evolution where you can take 85 rated to 90 or the lower versions to a plus 5 upgrade so we are going to be looking at two of the cards that i've already done and i'll be showing you guys some of the other cards that you can do as well and i'll let you guys know which is the best card to do for this birthday magic evolution now without any further ado let's get into this video okay first off we have two of this we have birthday magic one and we have birthday magic two i have completed both and i'll be showing you guys all the different stages of evolution the different upgrades you'll be getting and at the same time we'll go at the end of the video we will put these two players that i've done here currently in my squad that i've been using experimenting and doing all that good stuff and we'll see how good they actually are in game after the evolution now as you guys can see i have done marcus rashford for the first one and I've done Stephen El Sharave for the second one. Reason being, Marcus Rashford card for an 85 rated card to go to a 90 rated left wing card, his stats are pretty insane. And El Sharave is just because I love the player. He's my favorite player of the game, and I just am thrilled that I can get a good looking promo for him. And that was the reason behind this. He this was a 78 rated card, which I got to an 83 rated card and this one is an 85 rated card which i got to a 90 rated card now the level one for this birthday magic you're going to be getting plus one shooting you're going to be getting plus one passing plus one dribbling and plus one in physical and your 85 rated card will go to an 87 rated card so some of the upgrades are here so your 85 rated base card will be going to an 87 rated base card which includes improves your shooting passing dribbling and your physical so that is one thing and for to complete this you need to play three games and you have to score two goals with the evo player in the squad and for the part two is to complete the level two you'll be getting flair as a play style you'll be getting plus one passing again you'll get plus one passing plus one shooting again you'll get plus one pace and plus one physical for the level two upgrade so your 87 will go to a 90 rated card but this is not the final 90 rated card that you'll be getting uh, and to complete this level 2 you need to complete 3 squad builds you need to win 3 squad builds i mean squad battles my bad i am panicking because these two cards are really really insane guys i can't wait to use the final card in the team and show you guys so for stage 2 you need to play 3 uh, rivals and you have to win 3 squad battles or rivals or champions with the player in the squad and you will get your base 90 rated final card basically this is the final card but for the final card you will be getting plus two pace here you'll get a rap playstyle plus which is rapid plus you'll get five star skill move you'll get plus three dribbling so basically in both the magic what you're gonna be doing is you're gonna be taking any player and you basically give them a five star weak not five star weak foot so don't get that wrong you'll get a five star skill move out of them so no matter what player you take see if i go to rashi's uh, final evolution he is going to be getting five star skill move and for el sharave's final evolution he'll be getting five star skill move now rashi does look like he already has five star skill move but his stats look insane now for the level three the final upgrade you need to play four rivals you need to score i mean you need to you need to win by at least two goals you need to win by at least two goals you need to win three squad battles i think and then you need to assist four uh, goals with this player so that is four assists you need to win three games with two goals lead and then you have to play four uh, rivals games so you'll be getting the final what do you call this final upgrade out of this so the final upgrade will be getting five star weak foot i mean five star skill more weak foot keeps coming in my mouth for some reason will be getting five star skill move and look at the upgrades you'll be getting plus two pace you'll be getting plus three dribbling you'll be getting the five star skill move and you'll be getting the rapid plus play style as well so we're going to be collecting rashi first and then 
I'll show you guys the stats. I'll show you guys the stats. Don't worry. This is the final stats for Rashi. He has gone from a 90 pace player to a 93 pace player. He has his shooting as his shooting and dribbling has improved drastically, guys. I love this card. Without this pace and uh, dribbling upgrade itself, he was really good. Now with this, we'll find out how good he is. And for the El Sharave card, which is the most exciting card for me, he was at 86 or 85 pace. I am not sure but he was at 85 or 86 pace I'm not sure but now he has an 89 uh, he has 89 pace with 83 uh, dribbling and his uh, shooting and passing has improved he's gonna be getting a rapid plus as well he's gonna be getting four star I mean five star weak foot as well he's gonna be getting plus two plus three for pace and dribbling so uh, what is respectively same thing same thing birthday magic one and birthday magic two is same thing you're just gonna be getting a five star skill move for any player you use and plus five overall upgrade for any player you use so he's gone from a 90 i mean 78 to an 83 which is plus five upgrade and even for rashi it was 85 to 90 which is plus five upgrades and all these mm, tiny things you know upgrades here and there so he's gone from an 86 el sharave space to an 89 and the card looks really good i love this player personal favorite player of all time let us get this evolution go put both of these guys in my squad that i've been experimenting with and see if these guys are any good before we actually put those two people put those two players in our squad and play a game and see how those two are in the game how those two evolutions have helped us we'll just look at the overview of this uh, evolution guys so first off level one upgrade will get plus two overall plus one shooting plus one passing plus one dribbling and plus one physical and in level two you'll get plus three so plus two and plus three from level one and level two itself you'll take your 85 rated to a 90 rated or you'll get the plus five overall no matter which uh, overall player you'll take you'll get plus one pace you'll get the flare uh what is that i think this is flare i don't think this is player plus so you'll get play style flare you'll get plus one physical plus one passing and plus one shooting with plus one pace as well and level three it is going to be play style plus which is rapid plus and plus four skills plus four dribbling and plus two pace plus four skills is basically plus four skill move and this is an overview i am using footbin right now to show you guys all this make sure you guys go check out before you actually do the evolution now some of the other players that you might want to use are here on the screen in front of you now i would suggest i would suggest go for a striker with one of these and for the second one go for a midfielder for the center back you already have the weak foot pick so don't waste it on a center back according to me go for a striker with one and the second one use it for a midfielder you'll be able to get two really good players out of this now like i said the reason i did el sharave is because i love el sharave is my favorite player of all time so i did el sharave and wanted to have a good promo for him so i did el sharave for the second one and my first one was rashi because his stats increase a lot now there is another striker who looks really good with uh, this promo who is uh, isaac from newcastle so make sure you guys uh, before you know doing it make sure you guys uh, go check that out as well because that is a really really good card to improve now let me just scroll down and see if i can find this arc if i can find this arc i'll show you guys how his card looks uh but yeah so yeah this is the isaac card that i was talking about you can use him to level up so he'll go from 86 pace this is the isaac window wild card player card so he'll get he'll get kst 6 to 89 pace his shooting will go from 85 to 87 his uh, dribbling will go from 90 to 94 and his physical from 77 to 79 and his pass also increases okay so you guys can see the base overall start you're gonna be getting a plus five skill move and a rapid play style plus in anything you guys do so this is another uh, striker that i was looking out for but i thought rashi is a really good left finger and i can use him as a striker so i thought i'll go in for rashi instead of isaac but yeah this is actually a good card make sure you guys don't miss out on this as well but yeah that brings us to the almost end of the video because we have to use those two players in a game i'll show you guys i'll just play squad battle and see how those two players have improved or not
So this is the squad I've been experimenting with. I've been playing with the uh, Rashia striker. We've been we got Kuman in the previous video in yesterday's video. Make sure you guys go check that video out as well. I I have shown my opinion whether it's a good card or not. And we have El Charave over here. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bring in El Charave instead of uh, Kuman. We're gonna put him there. Rashi is there. Uh, you know what? Since I love Komen so much, I might actually play him. Or you know what? We'll use Saka. We'll use Saka for this game. I did get Saka out of, uh, I think it was out of 83 times 2 or something like that. It was insane when I got Saka. And this is a three evolutions in this one squad. We have El Sharave from 78 to 83. We have Rashi from 85 to 90. And we have our lowly Raphael Veran whose weak foot peak evolution we completed. So he has 5 star weak foot. And he was also 80 rated, 85 rated. So he's gone to a 90 rated player as well. Now we'll go head over to squad battles. Put on some random difficulty game. And we'll see how these two players are. Left wing. El Sharave and striker Rashi. Okay, we'll just go with this bronze squad. I'm just gonna play this squad just to show you guys how these players actually are, guys. It's not something I'm not gonna sit here and competitively play anything. These two are strikers. No matter what, they'll be decent up front. So we'll just see how they are. So first off, Rashi's uh, dribbling and pace. We have to look. His dribbling is really good. No matter what card he is, his dribbling is really good and his pace is actually not bad. Uh, he has 93 pace now. Okay, El Sharave. Now, El Sharave's cross has been on point for the few games that I've been trying. But this was a bit embarrassing. Because it didn't go to the place where I wanted, where I aimed. But we'll keep trying, we'll keep trying. El Sharave's pace is really good. He's, uh, he's really, really insane, guys. I love this player too much. And Rash is also really good at pace and dribbling. So... Basically, the two players I have chosen both are attackers. So um, what I'm going to be doing is I'm just going to be showing their pace and their, their dribbling. And I am getting destroyed by a bronze team in squad battles. How embarrassing is this? Shooting. Why is it awful? Why is it very awful right now? <laughs> I have played with these two boys a lot. And these two guys are really good, but I don't know when I hit the record button, what happens to me is just so awful, 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 whatever fool it is, it's just full of me. I'm making a fool out of myself. This guy has rapid plus and I'm just doing comedy with him. He has good finishing though, Rashi. He has good finishing. El Sharave has good track back also. So if you guys uh, want to track back, if you guys lose the ball and somebody is chasing down the wing, you guys can definitely use El Sharave. He's going to track back really well. He, he doesn't have that much defense, but surprisingly really good with track backs. Rashi's shooting is really good, guys. Rashi's shooting is really good. Now, definitely, you guys have to do this birthday magic thing. The main reason for this evolution is to show you guys what players you can use, uh, how, what, you know, what and all improves, what and all increases. So, if you guys are looking for a evolution with a good de promo design for some of your players that you've been enjoying a lot with and you want to increase, give them a good promo card, you can use this promo. If you want to take a 85 rated player, whom you want to use a lot in your squad and send them to 90 rated and use them actually for proper rivals or champions grind you can do that as well you get two of this birthday magic one and birthday magic two so I, my suggestion is use one for attacking one for def, uh, one for midfield defense use the weak foot peak make sure you guys check out that video i would have put that in the i card in the beginning of the video make sure you guys go check that out and yeah that is that brings us to the end of the video hope you guys enjoyed this video hope the first half was good i know the game part was horrifying very bad but it's just me you know it's just me but yeah i'll see you guys in the next one until then take care stay safe stay motivated and keep smiling bye bye